Hey guys, so we're back again with another Sonic Speed Simulator video, and today we're going to be looking at the world premiere of Sonic Prime. This is the new Sonic Prime event in Sonic Speed Simulator. This morning at 10 a.m., they unveiled the world premiere, which is essentially just the first episode of Sonic Prime, but they're streaming it in Sonic Speed Simulator right now. As you can see here, the next showtime is in 18 minutes. We were able to watch the very first one that aired this morning, and uh, I'll play a couple quick clips from that. And that's Green Hill, where the best beaches, palm trees, and chili dogs are just the tip of the iceberg. We've saved this place a million times from this doofus. <laughs> but essentially you go into this viewing area where you can watch the show, which is really, really incredible. Unfortunately, there's a lot of like players around and they can be jumping around and obstructing your view, which is a little bit distracting, but Hey, I guess we can't really complain. We get to see the episode five days early, so it's uh, really, really cool. So over here we have Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles with a pile of chili dogs and popcorn. Knuckles is like laughing for some reason, I don't know why. And over here we have Rouge in her Sonic Prime outfit, Big the Cat, and Amy. And we also have a new tag arena called New Yoke City instead of New York. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> so this little zone is interesting because it has all these little tent areas. And you can, if you don't want to watch from over there, you can go all the way up here and watch from above, away from all the distractions of all the people jumping around down there, I guess. Over here we have a nice little buffet and a free popcorn chow, which is uh, free for everyone to claim. So make sure to go grab your popcorn chow that looks hilarious with a bag of Netflix popcorn as his head. Here we have some free exclusive Sonic Prime uh, accessories for your Roblox character. And these are the different tasks that you need to complete in order to get these. So the event really takes place here. I mean, the viewing party takes place here where you can watch the episode and that's great. But the event in game happens over here in the tag arena. So essentially you'll come over here, wait for players to join. Unfortunately, the big issue with tag right now is that as you can see, no one's around. So I literally cannot even make progress in the event unless other people are around, which is really, really annoying. I wish that I could just make progress on my own, but of course it's a multiplayer game. Over here, you're, you would be running around in this tag arena and tagging other players and every time you tag somebody or your team tags somebody you get some points and you make your way through the event so luckily i actually already completed the event let's take a look at it watch what happens next to sonic and his friends on december 15th only on netflix since we only saw the first episode we don't know what's going to happen in the other episodes so you're supposed to collect all these crystals um, or prisms, I, I forget what they're called. And the first thing that you unlock is the prism trail, which uh, doesn't have that great of benefits, but it's all rainbow colored and looks cool. And then you unlock two popcorn chow, followed by two more popcorn chow. And with your extra popcorn chow that you get for free, you can then combine them all and make him pretty damn useful. He has a magnet ability, which is useful. And then from there, you unlock Rusty Rose, who's like the robotic version of Amy that appears in Sonic Prime. And finally, you unlock Sonic in the New Yoke style, where he has the gloves and the brand new awesome shoes. So we're playing as Sonic right now. And uh, yeah, I mean, he looks great. He looks, uh, of course, just like he did in the show. And we're gonna go ahead and combine our popcorn chow real quick. Okay, so now his benefits are 925 XP, 475 rings, and he's only at level one and one magnet ability, which is pretty damn good. I think our other chows are still better though, so I'm not going to replace one of our other chows with him, but that's uh, not bad at all, to be honest. And let's take a look at Rusty Rose, because I haven't even seen her in game yet. She definitely looks very, very weird, especially in the show. She's like, oh my god, yeah, look at those long ass legs. She's like weirdly tall in the show. And uh, here they made her a bit shorter, but you do see a, a glimpse of how tall she is there for a quick second. Oh my god, when she jumps, it's she like extends her legs. That was weird. It's just, I don't know, there's something very unsettling about that, I find. They just made her very tall for no reason. 
and uh, I, I, I don't know about that. It's a little bit strange. As you can see, there are also new Sonic Prime posters in the game showing a December 15th release on Netflix, which is gonna be great. I can't wait to watch the entire series on Netflix. And I'm shortly gonna be uploading a review of the first episode, so stay tuned for that. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Right now, we're really trying to get a thousand subscribers, so if you guys could help me out with that, that would be incredible. Oh my god, look how friggin' tall she is. She looks so weird. Oh my god, I gotta switch back to Sonic. That is just too weird. But overall, I don't have much uh, else to say about this event. It was actually not bad at all, I would say. The only issue is making the event tag-based is a little... It's a little unfortunate because I was playing this morning right when the premiere was happening and the tag arena was a lot more active so I was able to clear through the event very quickly, very easily and it, it wasn't a problem at all. But as you can see right now, I just went back to the tag arena trying to show you guys what it looks like and I can't even show you a glimpse of it because there's not even a single player around so I think they're relying a little too much on these multiplayer games when the game is not active enough to <laughs> warrant all these little multiplayer mini games. Like if you're just playing alone, you just literally cannot complete the event sometimes, which is unfortunate. So anyway, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Usually I show you guys some tips and tricks on how to complete the events a little bit quicker, but this time there's not really any any tricks, you know, you just play tag. Once you see someone running and you're chasing after them, you just kind of look at where they're going and try to run towards where they're going and try to tag them. And that's about it. I can't really give you guys any more advice other than that. I'm not sure if the event chow help you collect more crystals as you tag people. Maybe they do, but I'm not 100% sure about that. So I can't confirm or deny that. But anyway, uh, for me, it took under an hour to complete this entire event. It was really, really quick and really easy, which is great. I mean, it's an easy way to collect two new characters. But as I said, it's easy if the tag arena is active. If it's not, then you're kind of out of luck, which is unfortunate. But anyways, that's going to be it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and comment down below and subscribe to your boy. As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take it easy. Peace.